I do think it's worth touching on a few industry developments and macroeconomic drivers in the, uh, in the coming year. Uh, obviously, the war in Ukraine, um, as well as the global supply chain challenges linked to COVID-19, uh, has exacerbated some of the upward pressure that we've seen on inflation globally, which has in turn resulted in aggressive interest rate hikes by both local um, and offshore central banks. This unfortunately has created a large divergence in potential return scenarios across asset class, geographies and of course, uh, importantly for us, in, in, in the performance of the RAND. We've also seen and continue to see a large amount of delistings from regulated markets globally, both in the JSE, S&P and everywhere else. Um, and we're seeing an increased demand for solutions uh, within the private market space. And this is especially true in areas that support environmental, social and governance issues, also called uh, ESG matters and impact investing. Uh, we're also seeing a global energy and cost of living crisis and uh, you know, the added challenge of ESKIM uh, locally uh, in, in, in this regard. Just focusing on the local retirement reform developments, um, you know, the proposed two-pot systems and an increase in offshore allowances in terms of when it can go offshore, it's also going to shape the industry and it's also going to drive investor decisions. And then lastly, the evolving and increasingly onerous requirements uh, within the regulatory uh, environment, as well as the potential grey listing of South Africa by the Financial Action Task Force, or FATF, um, you know, if this is realised, it is certainly going to put pressure on, on businesses, both in terms of cost as well as access to foreign capital. But we believe as a business that we are well positioned to weather the storm. You know, our high touch approach with a client-centric business model and multi-generational relationship is a clear competitive advantage. We have established a growing team of investment professionals with an excellent track record both locally and offshore. We continue to build on a seamless client experience supported by technology. And I think you know, key for us and where we are in our journey is that we are big enough to be credible but small enough to be nimble and agile in a very, very competitive market.